Hello, my name is Amy Ecker and welcome to my channel. So today I did an eye to eye, head to head, face off using the, let me dig it out, the Bad Habit Luna palette and the Norvina palette. So I did one palette on one eye and the matching colors on the other eye. So I asked my aunt who's here from California visiting, which eye did she think was the real palette and which one did she think was the duplicate. So I closed my eyes. She was actually obviously more up close and personal than you are, but um, I had her look at both eyes and asked her which one obviously did she think was the real versus the fake. And she chose the real being my right side and it in fact was the Luna palette from Bad Habit. So she liked how the Luna palette blended better than the ABH Norvina palette. So let's talk about both palettes real quick. So both palettes are absolutely stunning. We know Bad Habit doesn't ever take long before they will do a duplicate of an ABH. Their palette is slightly longer, about the same width, and doesn't have the really plush, um, nice exterior like the Norvina palette. But now, I've only used the Luna palette once. It does have some fallout or kickback, so you want to be prepared for that. But nothing that the ABH doesn't already have. And you guys have heard, if you watched any of my other previous ABH videos, that I always seem to complain about the fallout of these palettes. So I would say Luna has actually less fallout than the ABH. But what I like better about the Luna versus the ABH is, look at the ABH. Now I have used it, um, say, I think I, I've done maybe three or four looks with four YouTube, three for sure. Um, but you can tell those glitter beautiful ones, they look like I've dug into them. Again, only three or four uses out of it. Now, I did use two of them. I used this one and this one for today's eye look. And in all honesty, they went on better. I don't know if this version here is just too creamy, and that's why those palettes look like they're dug into. But I find that the Luna palette actually is um, maybe not as soft, which makes it so much easier to put on. And they just, again, blend really well. So I have the Luna on my right eye, and I really like how it came out. I would say that the colors aren't 100%. How about that? They're not 100%. They're not 100% maybe dupes. They're, they're a little bit off in shade, um, especially this one that's by my ring finger down here. And its dupe is up here. A little bit different. I would say the Norvina palette has maybe s some more pigmentation, so you have to be carefuler putting this one on where the Luna was able to be built up much easier. I, I don't know, the, the Luna palette, it was just a ton easier to use. Um, again, the colors aren't spot on, but once you get them on your eye, you can't really tell a difference. I mean, overall, it looks like I use the same palette in my estimation. So just wanted to give you guys an update on the Luna Bad Habit palette versus the Norvina. Since Bad Habit keeps doing such a great job and sometimes like this one being better than Anastasia's original, I'm not going to be purchasing the ABH Sultry palette. I think the Sultry palette has a lot of the colors that are in the previous palette. So if you've been purchasing the ABHs, you're kind of doubling up on a lot of those colors. So I'm just gonna go ahead and wait until Bad Habit comes out with their duplicate because again, for all the dupe videos I've done on Bad Habit versus ABH, I really, really like Bad Habit. These are about $16 versus maybe 40 to 45-ish on the ABH. And if you're gonna get a better payoff at $16, better blendability, buildable color that is almost spot on, why would you spend 45-ish on an ABH palette when you can wait a few more weeks for Bad Habit to put out one that's gonna be better and a hell of a lot less expensive? Again, those are my thoughts. 
Um, would love to hear your thoughts if you guys picked up the Luna versus the ABH. I know a couple of um, my viewers were waiting for the Luna to come out and it's out. Um, I actually emailed one of the my viewers to say, hey, Bad Habits got their Luna out and want to say hello to Miss Sis because it's actually Miss Sis's mom. So anyways, hope you guys like this video tutorial. Actually, no tutorial, all video and review. And please leave your comments below. I love hearing from you and really, really want to hear what you think about this Luna versus the Norvina palette. Talk to y'all soon. Have a great one. Until next time. Bye.